Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name's Alexa J. If you haven't been here before, nice to meet you. So today I will be showing you guys what I bought. This is a haul and this is the stuff that I bought to go on holiday. So if you don't know, um, I haven't mentioned where I'm going. I'm going to Ghana for a long time actually <laughs> with my kids and my husband and the rest of my family, like moms, mother-in-laws, um, sisters, sister-in-laws, like it's a, it's a big family affair. Is this all tangled? What am I looking at here? Is this in place? Okay, yeah, it's a big family affair and um, some might not say it's a holiday well i don't come from ghana i come from nigeria so when i go back home i say nigeria but when i'm anywhere about nigeria is a holiday to me so and ghana is lovely i've been twice now been privileged enough to go twice um i went early this year in january for a month and i went last year november for two weeks and it was just an incredible experience and i was pregnant both times so this time i really want to enjoy myself um and the kids were my hu my, my my husband my son my firstborn absolutely loves it and then obviously i've got a five month old who'll be like six months when we go and he's gonna absolutely just lap it up so yeah this is a haul showing you guys some of the things that i bought some things are still on their way some things i'm still contemplating buying so i haven't got everything here there are other things that i have bought that are still upstairs but i honestly can't try everything on because I need to pack. We're going next week. I need to pack my stuff. So I've just tried on a few bits for you. And you'll see them throughout this video. Um, I went high end, low end. I shopped for bargains. Um, and yeah, I mean, most of, not most of the stuff. But I did get some really good stuff from Bista. But Bista Village. This is one of the pieces. This is actually a Missoni um, mesh turtleneck that I'm going to wet in Ghana these are anything long sleeve um or just a bit thicker I will tend to wear in the evenings because of mosquitoes and just because you know it's a bit cooler in the evening you can probably get away with wearing things that are long sleeve and a little bit thicker but in the daytime obviously I might not wear something like this I may wear something like this because it's very thin it's mesh material of course you can see right through it um but I have got some other bits that are definitely evening wear so without further ado, let's get into this video. Right, so I, like I said, I shopped high end and I shopped low end. I bought quite a few bits, just a few bits. Not, I bought things that complement each other. I bought outfits, I bought dresses, I bought little bits and pieces. Um, like I said, there are still some things I've bought that are on their way. I've bought a Bottega bikini from Classless and I've also bought a bralette from them and it's another Bottega um, item. Bottega, Bottega, Bottega. I mean, put, I just love Bottega, Veneta clothes and accessories. Like it is my favorite brand right now. I just love it. And in Bista Village, as mentioned, they had some incredible bargains there. I went twice and got two different items at two different times. And those were the ones in the thumbnail actually. So I'll just start off the video with those. So first off is this Jody, the Jody cloth bag um, in white. Now I was a bit skeptical because I've already got a white bag, but white is so on trend for summer and for um, holidays. I mean, white just, it just, it just makes sense. It looks a bit like tissue paper, <laughs> but white just makes sense. And I thought, oh, do you know what? I will get it um i did think about you know like makeup and stuff like that you know the handle that's gonna be a bit tricky but the fact that it's cloth i can definitely wash this i can take it to the dry cleaners and give it a good clean if it does get all mucky but i will be very conscious i'll wash my hands often obviously i wash I'm supposed to wash your hands anyway i sound dirty but no what i'm saying is that greasy hands um hands with makeup will not be touching this bag my hands will definitely always be clean so that I don't ruin it too much. But I absolutely love this bag. It goes with a lot of things like my other Jodie. I don't know where she is. Oh, there she is. <laughs> this is my other Jodie, which I absolutely, I love this bag. Like, and it goes really, complements this top as well. I love this top because I can wear so many different colors from it. So, this is the other Jodie I have. And for size reference, I mean, they're not much different in size. So this one's double knotted. It's made from cloth material. And this one's made from 
the most buttery leather that you could ever feel it's so soft and obviously it's a single knot bag so those are my two jodies and yeah this is one of the items that i got from vista village in bottega veneta and i decided to wear this with a few outfits so one of the outfits i did try it on with so i'm gonna have to look at my phone for reference because i actually can't even remember so i did try this on with a beautiful rat and boa two-piece i've had my eye on this rat and boa two-piece for a long time i've seen some influencers wear it and they wear it so beautifully um and i thought you know what and it's in my favorite color can you guess can you guess guys it's not hard to guess so this is the rat and boa it creases so easily because i actually steamed this before i um before i wore it so this is the rat and boa piece that i got it comes with a skirt a matching skirt i didn't realize and i do love that actually that the skirt is made from like satin silk so i in the images they actually look like they're from they're the same made from the same material but you can see that this is satin satin or silk and it's very thick not very thick but it's thick and i just love it like this is not even doing any justice so i'll pop the video here where you guys can see me trying it on with the white jody um and this is the top i love the long sleeved details now that is the little flared sleeve details that is gorgeous and it's listen i'm not gonna lie it's got the longest <laughs> the longest um tie belt wrap for the top it's so long but it gives this whole flowy vibe it's just gorgeous like on the beach or you know sandbox we love a bit of sandbox in ghana and accra so when i go sandbox i'll probably wear this or when i go to i don't know somewhere beachy giving me like beach vibes i will definitely be wearing this and i love that they're two pieces so i can wear them with other items that i have or, or existing items that i do have so that is the rat and boa i also wore it with um i think i wore it with another bag yes i actually paired it with my jody as well so you can see that there as well i paired it up with my jody so sorry guys i have to look because i can't remember my memory is like fish next is this little asos dress so it's from a brand on asos called dun 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 eighth hour i got this in a size 10 oh sorry the rat and boa i got both of them in mediums because i'm busty and your girls put on a little bit of weight down there so i got mediums in this i got a 10 because i wanted to, it to be fitted so this is a little colorful mesh dress i can't remember how much it is but everything will be linked in the description box below for you guys um i love this because it's just cute i can wear it up i can wear it down i can wear it with sandals i can wear it with um really rock it like this but i think that's a bit too yeah it's a bit clashy isn't it i did actually wear it with my bottega heels which is the other item that i got from Bista village and oh my god i love these beautiful beautiful shoes i love them what i do love is this this spirally ankle piece that just steals the show with the gold detailing on the end now i don't have trousers long enough i think i've got i bought some white linen trousers and i they are quite long so i could probably do it with that what i love is when people wear these shoes and they wrap this the um ankle strap spiral ankle strap around the trousers that that look is just it's just painfully beautiful <laughs> i love it and yeah that's how i would wear it if i was going to wear it with trousers um two of the trousers that i wore today are not long enough i tried i tried it didn't work but i've got another pair of linen trousers that i'm taking with me and they're quite long so hopefully i'll be able to achieve that look away i didn't film that unfortunately but i did film these two together and they just worked so well so the um this is actually red but because it, it's mesh it looks quite light and worn together it was gorgeous i wore it with my daniel de bag my 
tiny tote it comes with a strap actually i showed this on my birthday haul comes with a crossbody strap but i would obviously wouldn't be wearing it like that i would just wear it with a top handle and with these items with these items and it's like different shades you know you've got a bit of a coral here you've got an orange here and a bit of red and then you've got the blues and the yellows and it's just so it's just so summery and holiday and just it's just lovely so that is this outfit these both takers i got 39 i'm a straight 39 now price these were 1200 so 1224 i got them for 613 so i got them for literally half price um i can't remember how much this was but i will post it down below along with the daniel Duprier um bag if you guys are interested next up what else did we get so um my next outfit i got i was looking for a really nice cut out dress i didn't manage to find one and to be fair i don't feel like i'm ready to wear cutouts just yet just because i don't my body is not where i want it to be i have lost weight thank god i'm so happy i've lost weight but i'm still not where i want to be i still have weight to lose i still want to tone up so i'm gonna get a personal trainer in ghana i'm gonna holler at um a friend of mine called just jean a lot of you probably follow her on instagram she's um, an amazing personal trainer and i think i'm going to reach out to her i'm finally gonna bite the bullet and just get a personal trainer because even though i've lost weight i know that i could have lost more i know i could be in better shape but because i don't like people telling me what to do so i avoided it but I'm going to bite the bullet and get her. She's going to be in Ghana. So I'm going to go to her. I know she's going to have like training events with girls, train to slay, all that kind of stuff. That's her brand. So I'm just going to do that. And um, yeah, I'm going to holler at her and train with her and hopefully bring that down to the UK when we come back. So how did I get to that? Cut out dresses. Not ready to wear them yet, unfortunately. So I did just opt so when i was searching i came across a brand called meshki which i've never heard before and i liked a lot of their pieces and it's just unfortunate that i could get them but i did get a lovely yellow satin dress and i think yellow on black girls is just top tier so i got this and it looks so expensive it was 60 pounds but it just looks like million dollar stuff on me you know it's just a simple slip silk i mean satin dress and i like that it's not so shiny because some of them satin dresses be shining girl like this good ball and you just end up looking quite cheap so i like that this isn't too shiny and it's like straight cut across it's so flattering across the boobs i'm not wearing a bra in the video but i will be or i'm gonna have to do a lot of tit tape <laughs> stuff when i wear this because it is strappy at the back so even if i did want to wear like a strapless bra you would see all that business at the back and i could possibly get the strapless bras that just you know hold up on the front but i'm a busty girl so that's not gonna work for me unfortunately i'm not an a cup or b cup where my tits are up here <sighs> my tits. that sounds so bad when my boobs are up here so um we've had kids we're breastfeeding that's just the honest truth of the matter so i will find a way to wear this and make sure that everything is compact and together but i absolutely love it and i paired it with my versace shoes as you can see in the video so love 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 that for me love it love it right next up we have these cute when i, talk, when I saw this i didn't like the top this was doing way too much but the shorts or squats this this girls you need it it's not even expensive like that i think it was like 25 pounds this is so they're so flattering like let me just put the video there for you guys i wore it with this i wore this and i wore it with this zara green shirt now this green business you not know how i feel about green like just give me all the green stuff i'm very careful about what i buy when it comes to green because i don't want to you know you don't want to be too much but i do love green that is my favorite color it's not a secret everyone knows so i paired this up and how good does how good does this look how good do i look tell me tell me tell me like the combination is just when i 
I think satin, anything satin silk for holiday just honestly looks incredible. So make sure when you're buying things, go for the satins, go for the silks. It's, they're so flattering. They're, it makes you look expensive. Like, I just love it. And these are two items that are very inexpensive. Can't remember how much this shirt was from Zara, but like I said, I'll link it below. This was about 25 pound, no more than 30. And it's a beautiful skirt, 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 yeah, skirt, short skirt. And I just, I loved this outfit, like I loved it. And I paired it with my Birkin, I believe. I don't think there's anything new that I paired it with. Let's have a look. Yeah, I paired it with my Birkin and my Bottega my Bottega stretch sandals these ones my toast shoes as my husband likes to call them so these are like toast so that's what we wore with that to two bags so I haven't got outfits for them in the new stuff that I bought so I'm just going to show you actually I did get an outfit for this but I'm not convinced with the outfit like you're going to see here it's not it's not banging like when i compare it to my other outfits it's it's not popping it didn't translate like i wanted it to so i wouldn't wear those two pieces together but i do love that knit shirt i mean it's from ghani and it is just beautiful 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 the quality the shirt with the knit i mean who th even thinks like that with the diamante crystal buttons i mean that was business and then i got this little bag and that's what i was going to pair it with with the black skirt and my amina muadis but i'm not feeling the outfit so this bag is a cute dupe it's not the alexandra wang one it looks exactly the same like as it but it's actually a dupe and we love a dupe i mean sometimes dupes are necessary because you want to make sure that you how about this? Oh, there's a strap. I was like, oh, what is that in there? Oh, there's a strap in here. Okay, cool. <laughs> so I can wear this crossbody if I wanted to. I'm so confused. I'm thinking, did they put something in the bag that was something to have? So we love a dupe, as I was saying. Um, dupes are good if you don't want to necessarily invest or commit to a bag or an item that you're not too sure about i mean if this starts falling apart like really badly really quickly then i'm gonna go and get the alexander white one because i do love this bag but for the meantime i mean i don't i didn't feel like spending 795 pounds on this bag so my sister-in-law found it and i was like oh i'm going to find it and it was from saffron in stratford westfield but this was the last one so sorry guys <laughs> but i just really wanted to show you and it was just 32 pounds i mean a fraction of the price like i'll pop the alexandra wang one there it's exactly the same the only difference is it doesn't have alexandra wang and that's the difference between dupes and copies or counterfeit items so a counterfeit item is if you are using the copyright of louis vuitton you're using their print you're using their even down to their receipts and their packaging and their dust bags that's counterfeit that's a copy of a bag that's illegal dupes on the other hand are not illegal they can be distasteful don't get me wrong because there are some brands that don't give a heck like they copy everything to a t they just put their own branding on it and i don't really like that too much this one is a really good dupe of the Alexander Wang one. I don't have many dupes. I just really, really liked it in general. I think even if Alexander Wang didn't come out with this bag, Diamante crystal bags are so on trend at the moment. They are so flattering. They're so cute. And they go with a lot of outfits. Everyone's going to be carrying one of these bags in one shape or form. So whether it was Alexander Wang or not, I would have got this anyway because I just think it's... I just think it's gorgeous like so cute i mean even with this yes so yeah that is oh my justification for buying this bag next up what's next on our agenda let's see hold on guys so i got a cute summer dresses now i love these kind of dresses i have a few of them from asos i have 
two, like a mustard one, and I've got a yellow one. A yellow one, yeah, yellow. I wore it in Ghana last year when I was pregnant, and then I've got a mustard one, and I wore it last year when I was pregnant. But I get these dresses because they're completely versatile. You can wear them when you're not pregnant, when you are pregnant. So this is just literally a cute summer dress from ASOS. It's got a little peephole here, and it's got this little puffy arm business this little scrunched up puffy yum and as you can see i have worn it with my bag this bag my loewe bag and i wore it with my hermes sandals that i got from the sale and i also wore it with my hermes hat which i was down there i can't want to reach for it so that's how i'll be wearing this lovely little number i like the color as well this teal green i don't have anything in this color so it's nice to have a difference and i got this from asos so again i'll be linking that down below and i hope you're enjoying these little clip aways of me wearing the clothes because i did listen to you guys you did say next time i do a haul can i try things on and i did i did your girl sweated she was stressed it was hard work but we did it we did it so i hope you're happy with that um next up is this rat and boa play suit oh you won't be able to see much of it now because it just looks like a big black slinky thing but it is so flattering i saw it on their website and i was like oh this this piece is really nice and yes it's black but again this is something i can wear in the evening to dinner because again i'm not here for the mosquitoes i'm here for vibes and good time the mosquitoes are militant so therefore we will cover our body in the night time so this is the arm the arm is such a beautiful balloon sleeve and it's scrunched up here around the wrist so you know you get that whole balloon effect and i in the video i'm wearing a bra i wouldn't wear i would not wear a bra with it when i wear this i will definitely um do like a whole taping situation and take the this part the v-neck down to my skin and just have like a nice flattering open chest kind of vibe deal and then tie the bottom it's gorgeous it's absolutely gorgeous i don't know what shoes i'm gonna wear yet i haven't decided they're quite long so i don't think you'll see the shoes anyway unless i'm like really kicking when i'm walking so i don't know what shoes i'm gonna wear with them just yet um what bag did I, I didn't even put a bag did i no oh yeah and i wore it with my valentino hat now i mean i could also wear this for editorial purposes for pictures on the beach that kind of vibe so i'll probably will be taking some really nice aesthetically pleasing pictures with them but i wouldn't necessarily in the evening sorry my forehead is shining i wouldn't necessarily wear it in the evening with this valentino hat but this hat is a big deal i mean look at that look at this lace like these hats are very on trend i mean straw hats are great for holidays anyway but what i'm talking about is these side kind of like tags i've got them on my loewe um bucket hat and they're also on this but this is actually removable so i can take these off if i didn't want them or i could also i'm sure i can find a way to like wrap it around all the way around and like tighten a bow so i don't have these but the option is there and just for reference i did end up bending down to get the other hat these are the two hats i'll be taking on holiday i remember this hat that i said i might sell um i got shook i said sis i i, I need another birkin and i need to buy it from the shop so therefore we're not selling anything from that sale um this is the other hat that i'll be taking with me to ghana so i've got two hats and i've got some scarves as well that we've taken but they're not new you saw them in the hermes video <sighs> my throat is dry next up are these lovely pair of trousers from zara and they fit beautifully when i tell you everything is packaged as in the bum is packaged the hips are packaged the belly is even packaged everything is just packaged it just is so flattering 
so so flattering and it's one of those pieces that you're gonna wear and everyone's gonna know where it's from and that's one thing i absolutely cannot stand about zara but i can't i couldn't i couldn't give up these pants they came with a really nice shirt as well and it's black friday so i'm gonna go back and see if the shirt has gone into the black friday sale because i would love to buy the shirt to this and wear it together i wore it with the green shirt which i'm still gonna wear in that way but it'll be nice to have the matching shirt as well for versatility purposes so i absolutely love these pants they stick they, they're so flattering guys make sure you get them i think we're on the last item or oh, i've got some accessories that i'm going to share but when it comes to clothes we're on the last item so i got this i've wanted this for a long time and i'm so glad oh, i could have got it today in the black friday sale savannah moreau the label i love this brand i love her brand i love it i saw this on first i saw it on oh i think it's tanika i think that's her name then i saw it on nori and then i saw it on patricia and i said okay this is my sign to finally buy this item so i bought the trousers because i wanted trousers i didn't want to wear a skirt and the skirt's got some cut out business like i said i'm not ready for all that so i bought the trousers which are so flattering flared like linen light trousers and then they're just so gorgeous and this is the top and when i show you the top i think everyone will know what i'm talking about so i got this from netta potter i got it from netta potter and as you can see it cuffs around the boobs there's a picture of it and i've got it on with my chanel sandals and my chanel rope sandals and my low wave bag but i also tried it on with this bag which i popped on my instagram like sometime last week and when i tell you this bag this bag nothing until you see this bag in person nothing does it justice i mean can you see the detail here let me just cover my eyes and it'll focus yeah can you see that shine that is all over this bag i when i saw this on the outnet i thought it was rattan when it came on so pleasantly surprised it's, it's weighty as well like i mean it's just this is like the bag that goes inside in case you don't want people to see what's going on what you're carrying and for things to fall out well you don't need to use it you can if you want to um but i'm just here for this bag and there was another version of it because this one sold out so i will link it anyway just in case it comes back and stop but the outlet I'm, I'm, as far as i'm concerned nothing comes back and stop there but there is an alternative same rope details same material just a different style of bag i know a few people have already bought it thank you very much for following my recommendation but this bag is just so beautiful it literally is one of my favorite items for this holiday and it's by um regina pio yeah regina pio and i love her stuff her stuff is very beautiful i mean if i could get some more pieces i would but i've spent so much money so much money um yeah and i paired it up with that i also got this bag from zara which is just cute little slinky hobo bag it was only 25 pounds i really liked it and this is something i would have forever because it will always come back in the trend this trends repeat themselves all the time but i i really like this i know this is something that i would keep for a very long time so such a cute bag and then i also got i didn't get to show you this but this is the gani top oh i forgot to take off the paper <laughs> the paper on the buttons but yeah and as you can see the the crystal buttons if i hide can you see it no it's not focusing but it's just so beautiful but again in the evening when i'm going to a restaurant and sitting under their blasting cold ac this you will thank me when you bought something like this because 
AC in a hot country is no joke and we're not used to it and personally I don't like AC because it always gives me a cold so I just like to dress appropriately when I'm going to restaurants and things like that <sighs> okay so last but not least from what I remember this is I mean there are like I said there are some other bits upstairs but honestly guys I can't show everything but I will be wearing everything so I will link most everything in this everything i've shown today i'll link in the description box below make sure you're following me on instagram um at alexis aj at alexis underscore aj make sure you follow me there because i link most of everything everything i'm gonna wear i'm definitely gonna link it so make sure you check it out or follow me so you can see um i also got this bikini from oh it's very bright on here but imagine that on my skin on holiday that's very nice isn't it and it's got a cut out i know what i said i know what i said but it actually looks quite nice on this one and it's a swimsuit so it's a bit different than walking around in a cut out dress and everything's shaking so um this is from asos love got a pair of earrings from jacques jacques and the lovely Jade Van Rial has them too. I was like, oh Jade, I've got those earrings. And they're just so cute. I'm still living through those Chanel pair of earrings that are now £1,000 on eBay. I want them, but I haven't got them yet. And they're still there in my watched item. One day I will get them, but I just love them. They're like hoops with a Chanel hoop and a pearl inside. I'm just like... That's actually what made me buy my Miu Miu earrings. And I saw these on, where did I see them? I think Browns, yeah, I got these from Browns. And I just love them. Love, they're so cute. These are my second pair of um, Jacquemus earrings with this little Chiquito bag. And that is the only time I will wear that Chiquito bag via jewelry. You will never see me carry that me to my word i will not carry that back <laughs> and finally something i have been looking for so basically every time i want to get these glasses i mean i just i just never bought them i don't know why why did i not get them i think the price at the time i was just like i'm not paying that anyway i never got these glasses and they're so popular all the fashion girls have them um and I just love them i love them i've seen them on people i think they look great and every time i go to bista i've been to bista like four or five times in the last year and every time i go in there i'm like oh do you have the, the glasses and like no we don't have them sorry they always sell out if they come in they go straight away or they don't send them to us because everyone buys them this time i was even leaving the shop yeah husband had bought what he wanted and i was leaving the shop and i just thought oh let me just ask Oh, do you have the Loewe Ibiza Paula glasses? And they're like, hmm, let me see. They went to the drawer that they always go to, pulled it out, and I was like, oh, yes, them! And she pulled them out, and I tried them on, and I said, I don't even care if they don't see me. I love them. I love them, and I got them the iconic colour as well. So let's just try them on. Oh my God, this is a moment. yes mm. i love these glasses i love them so much they're just so fashion forward and i just think they're just so cool like i mean i'm being honest if people weren't wearing them i probably wouldn't wear them but i've seen them on so many people that i love them i love them and i wanted them i've wanted them for a long time and i'm finally i'm glad that i finally got them and this is the color i've always wanted i was watching a pair on ebay actually but um they want the right yellow it was like a mustard yellow i didn't really want that one but i got these from the loewe in vista village and i got them for 100 pounds 100 pounds 100 these i think these glasses are like 300 and something but I got them for 100 pounds. So, and I love the case as well. I had an option to pick a muted colour. I said, no, I want, I want all the fluorescent and all the brightness. Thank you very much. So, that's my haul done and dusted, guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed that. 
um i'm really excited for my holiday i'm really excited to go away it's been a while i'm there for a very long time so i had to buy quite a few bits um like i said there's still some bits coming and there's still some things i'm contemplating and that have gone into the black friday sale and i'm like alexis do you need this but i do so excited times um thank you for watching if you like this video and you want to see more videos like this make sure you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you have not subscribed please subscribe love to see more of you make sure you tell me in the comments your favorite outfit as well what one's your favorite for me it's the green pieces i'm in love with the green pieces like they just green has my heart so those were my actual favorite items um bearing in mind in those videos my hair's not going to be like this i wasn't wearing always wearing the right underwear so my looks are going to look better than that um but this is what we're dealing with at the moment so until we go i've got a hair appointment tomorrow so hopefully we'll get all that sorted out thank you for joining me on this haul i hope you loved it and i will see you guys soon take care